Hi there, I'm Christopher Dunnigan. This is Handmade in Vermont.com, and today we're talking about the Hubberton Forge pendant called the Regalia. This is the 139881. This is a dedicated LED low voltage pendant. We'll kind of go over that stuff in a second. Why don't we talk about the size of the fixture body? And that's going to be the bottom part where all that heavy forging is before you get to your cables. This is. Um, how big is this? 13.5 inches tall, so it's actually pretty um, short ceiling friendly, we're going to call it. 29.7 inches by 30.3 inches in diameter. So it's a, it's a good size for a 60 inch, 74 inch, 84 inch long dining table. Also great if you have a foyer or an entry hall. Better than 9 feet probably. This starts off at 30 inches overall height. Most places for code is 7 feet above the floor if you're going to be walking under something. So if you're going to be putting this in a foyer, I would expect it to be about 9, 10, 11 foot at, at the shortest foot ceiling, just so you know. So uh, this is going to be hanging from three cables, and those cables are going to be going up to a triangular canopy, and that canopy is 8 inches by 9.2. It's kind of a triangle. Um, and they have grippers inside, and during your installation, those cables are going to be going into these grippers, and they have a strain relief on them where you just kind of push it in with your thumbnail, and it'll allow it to go in and out. And then when you are done, you're going to be clipping those wires, and you have to get them to where you want them to be. So make sure you have it level, and it's exactly where you want it to be before you clip those wires. There is a transformer and drivers in the canopy that are going to be running those LEDs on this. So just kind of keep that in mind. <clears throat> Overall height, now we're talking about the distance from the bottom of the fixture to the ceiling itself. Minimum is going to be 30 inches coming down. Maximum is 100. Um, some of you may want to have this installed less than 30. There's a possibility that technically it can be done, but the, um, the design preference is 30 inches from the ceiling down. <clears throat> if you need this longer than 100 inches, I could probably do this as a custom. Just email us and tell us what you're looking for. So this is going to, do, this is going to be delivering 850 lumens out of 23 watts of LEDs. What looks like glass is actually uh, forged acrylic. So what happens is you have strips of LEDs that are inside this, kind of like the flux, if you guys have ever seen the flux pendant, and they're pushing light like a fiber optic through that forged acrylic, and then that is kind of radiating out from there. Beautiful fixture. Um, let me see if there's anything else that really is important as far as those things go. Um, why don't we get into finishes. If you're on our website, handmadeinvermont.com, midway down, left hand side is the finishes help guide. Give that a click for me. That's going to have a video screen at the top and that's me talking to you about the differences in Hubberton Forge finishes, translucent versus opaque, how it looks, how those things can look on heavy forging and this actually does have a lot of heavy forging so it's important to pay attention to that video. Scroll down a little bit on that page and you're going to see a chart. That chart is going to have pictures of all the nine different finishes you can order this fixture in. Some of the pictures will have the letter A on them, some will have the letter B on them. That'll talk about the differences in heavy forging versus non-heavy forging and how that affects translucent finishes. That'll all be talked about in the video above. So watch the video, come down, use that chart. When you're done with all that, you can click on that chart on any of those pictures and see a, a pop-up window with lots of different items and whatever finish you guys just clicked on. So I think that covers that. Um, the only, the only thing you can really pick on this is going to be your finishes. As far as the, the heights go, it's, uh, it's during your installation. It's pretty user friendly. Canopy you already know about. Lumens you know about. Um, delivered watts, those kind of things. Uh, when you buy your Hubberton Forge fixture from handmadeinvermont.com, shipping is free to every state except Alaska and Hawaii. No tax if you ship out of the state of Vermont and we're the only dealer with 90 day returns. There's no restocking fees. Uh, go back to our website and check details on that because some of the bigger things can't come back, so it's important for you to check on that for me. Um, in addition to that, we have a rush program. Normal Hubberton Forge production time is three to four weeks. We can cut that time in half for you if you guys need us to. It's very inexpensive. Just let us know if you need to do that, and we can, we can give you details on that as well. Our showroom has over 350 Hubberton Forge fixtures spread across two floors, biggest showroom in the world. Showroom is open every day except Sunday from 11 to 6, and then you can call us every day except Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Time, and I'm here to talk to you. In addition, we have a clearance center here. Clearance center is 75% off MSRP. 
discontinued showroom samples returns you guys have to come in to use that but it's a lot of fun as well so i think that wraps everything up if i missed anything let me know drop a quick email sales at handmadeinvermont.com and we spell out the word vermont or you can call 802-446-2400 thanks for stopping in today we'll talk to you guys soon take care Bye bye